We're here to talk to you today about the Paxman Model 23. The Model 23 came out at the very end of the 1990s. Uh, development of it was started in 1996. Um, the development was a collaboration between Bob Paxman and Tim Jones. So without further ado, I'll pass you over to Tim to talk about the concepts behind the design and how it's evolved over time. Tim. Thanks, Steve. Um, <clears throat> Yeah, 1996 is a date that's firmly fixed in my mind because it's, um, Model 23 was the first horn that I'd had a direct design influence over. Unfortunately by then, um, Richard Merriweather wasn't uh, alive anymore, was no longer with us. So this is the first horn that I've had some direct design input into. Uh, the concept of the Model 23 was to combine some of the features of the traditional Gaia Knopf wrap with uh, some of the Paxman design philosophy. Um, now on, on a Gaia wrap horn, the air comes in here, it's like that, and the, the air goes through the B-flat horn in this direction. Um, but on the F side, it actually goes in the opposite direction. So what we've done with the model, with the um, 23, is keep the, the B flat wrap, pretty much similar to the guy wrap. Right then you've got this return slide here for that. But the F air goes in the same direction as the same as on model 20, both in the same direction. Um, and that has given us a horn that has some of the qualities of a, of a traditional guy horn, but with a, perhaps some design theory. A horn is a little bit more free blowing, I think, and also the uh, production, sound production is a little bit more immediate. Um, and one of the consequences of designing the horn like that and including a B flat tuning slide, which you don't have on a Gaia horn, but one of the consequences of that is that we have to raise, you see, the valve section has to be raised up a little bit to give us this. B flat tuning slide here, so on the guy, you don't, that's, that's a fixed slide, but we wanted to have a B flat tuning slide there, so we had to raise the valve section. Now we're just about to bring into production, excuse me, kind of out of focus there, this model in the right, this unlacquered horn. Now it's very similar to the uh, first model 23, but we've responded to some. Um, players worry about having a raised valve section. It gives sort of quite a wide hand position. So we've managed to keep all the same concept, but lower the valve section. So this has come down, which gives a, a, a hand position exactly the same as all our other horns. Um, and in order to do that, the eagle eye might notice that this B flat tuning slide has had to be and smaller because we've pushed the valve section down and all the other features and I think it's a really nice horn. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank <laughs> you.